Hi, we're Hi. back. Yes, for our queer movie reviews. Queer cinema reviews. Mm -hmm. And I'm never correcting you, I'm just giving She does you it all the time, but somehow we, you know, we truck on and make it through. Angelina Jolie uh, is next. Our next trilogy. Who, what lesbian <laughs> didn't at one point or another have a thing for her and or at wonder. least one movie? <laughs> Or wonder, yeah. is she gay? Is she gay? She's gay, right? Is she gay? I don't know. I shouldn't say that. I don't I'm, think I'm she is. Angelina Jolie. Foxfire. Trilogy. Gay and just like. It wasn't, I didn't, I definitely was at an age where I was probably very cynical towards film. So I think I kind of was like, oh, this movie's ridiculous. And then I think the last time I watched it, I really liked it. So I'm excited to come back at it with um, a new perspective of like reviewing and mm -hmm. what have you. And it is available to stream on Hulu. It's on Hulu. Which is amazing because I've had to like we usually rent to, it. and We've I, rented this movie several times. I think it was one of those I things. I used to own it. It's been a long time. And I'm so excited to, you know, review it and get everyone else to like check it out. Because I think it's a very it uh, under the radar movie. And it's it, phenomenal. And it has Jenny Lewis. Jenny Lewis. Jenny Shimizu. Like, it has a great queer cast. Yeah, you know, Jenny Shimizu good. was in Itty Bitty Titty Committee. She did you know, do a so little uh, cameo yeah, in she that. did. It was interesting. But she's so, in this movie. Like She's in ones. this movie. I was going to say, is that Susan Sarandon's daughter? I don't think it is, though. It's, is so. Susan Sarandon's daughter in this movie? Hmm. We're going to find, find out. out. <laughs> okay, we'll be back with our review. A Foxfire, 1996 Angelina Jolie classic. Definitely feel like um, I watched it a little more closely, mm -hmm. artistically. Yes, I really. Um, I mean, obviously, I've seen it before, but mm -hmm. watching it in a sort of like for what it is as a mm -hmm. movie, like I really like it. Like, um, so yeah. Now we can talk about the synopsis. Yes, break um, it down. So Angelina Jolie shows up at this high school. Totally comes in, saves the day, and <laughs> just dropped me off at the school to free the local girls. I'm on a tour. A tour of freedom. Yeah, is she even going to school? Uh, no. <laughs> Classic style of, you know, an event happens, it brings all these girls together, they all become BFFs. I don't even go here. I'm a teacher! I'm a white man! This is outrageous! You know, they just get into antics and stick up for things, and it's really good. They hit on a lot of really mm -hmm. heavy points. And they accurately show it, so it's a little, like, hard to watch. Content warning. I wouldn't say cringy because it's truly accurate. accurate. So it's like, where it, it's sad. Right, it's so you definitely feel that. Okay, so what is our rating system? So directing, mm -hmm. I think. Oh, is the fantastic. shots. The shots were amazing. Mm -hmm. Let's see, what like else? The angles they would get. Yeah. Would just be like. Oh, so I have so many good mirror shots, and she was like all about them, like crooked Dutch mm -hmm. angles. Annette Haywood Carter. Annette Haywood Carter. Uh, uh, uh. So she is known for. Oh. Not too much. Um, not a lot. Not a lot. Wow. Wow. All right. Well, thank you, Annette Haywood Carter, for this for brilliant, this brilliant piece. Piece because it it is artistically shot very well. I think 
it, two thumbs up for the direction two thumbs up for the direction and like just like the like story and like character development like I feel like they focus even though you can obviously tell like the main kind of like plot line being between like Maddie and Legs but each girl in the in the gang gets her time you know what I mean it is everyone's story is told Mm -hmm. And um, so you care about everyone. Mm -hmm. I feel like maybe Violet gets the I least. I was thinking that as I was saying that, but um, and I still don't know if that was Susan Sarandon's daughter. I don't think it was. I don't think so, but mm -hmm. she kind of looks like her. Set design. Mm -hmm. um, can I say I feel like it was almost overdone? Oh, I, I was literally thinking that because um, it was just like with the bathroom and like with her room it was a little overdone it was a it was yeah now that i'm looking back every single room was just and it's not inaccurate but just for my aesthetics since mm -hmm. that's what i'm judging it's very busy so i give that a one thumb because it's accurate for the time but it was a little heavy for me mm -hmm. i'm gonna give it two just because it like even though it's a lot yeah because it's like i feel like it's giving that some fantasyful thing like mm -hmm. something to aspire to you mm -hmm. know like i mean just i mean maddie's room is amazing even though it looks it's like a game cool. room <laughs> yeah it's so cool. it's like it's a, looks mm -hmm. like you're about to play laser tag but um so music obviously on point great through the whole yeah. movie that's a wicked two thumbs up for me yeah. And then what's the last one? Acting. Acting. Oh. Through the roof. Yeah. So good. Yeah. Uh, I would that say That end scene, Angelina. That... The way she does that, the intake of, like... Like, <laughs> like I don't know. Like, it's like... Like, it's the cave of her chest or something, but you feel her, like, literally, like... Oh, no. Like, I know. Like... The moment when she's sitting there waiting for her, you know, she's like, you know, you'll know when the bus pulls up or when the mm -hmm, car pulls mm -hmm, up, whatever. Mm -hmm. And then uh, she's looking at her like excited and the way she's able to shift that just on her mm -hmm. face. I've lost my breath mm -hmm, because this mm -hmm. moment has taken mm -hmm. everything from me. Mm -hmm. I'm like, and that's what makes this movie yes. go from very potentially cheesy to how this is a great, yeah, great film all the way through, mm -hmm. beginning to end. I mean, it is, it is brought to, it is, it's a story that is handled very well. So I mean, despite mm -hmm. my giving so maybe I give one and a half on set design and we'll just round it up to a good solid four thumbs for the movie. I like it. I like it. I think Fox is by by far means balance. I think thumbs. this is definitely one of the movies that if anybody's gonna watch out of these suggestions do it. It's on Hulu. It borders that yeah. line of gay, you know, so yeah, the, the gay, it talk, I mean, even in the like synopsis, they talk about it. Yeah. we all know Aunt Legs is gay. Yes. Um, and she says, don't worry, you're not my type. But, oh yeah, yeah, it's just that very like teen angsty. Mm -hmm. You know, it's 96, line. you couldn't show that. You know, no. this would have drove, I would have known I was gay probably instantly if I saw this movie. <laughs> instantly. Um, because <laughs> it really is just seeing it. Yeah. You don't realize how much it's not shown in a positive light until you realize it hasn't. Yeah. So, yeah. Any last thoughts about this wonderful movie? There's, yeah, just the content warning. Mm. There's some, you know, um, no animals are harmed in the making of this film, but it does get pretty close 
Mm -hmm. So, yeah, it's hard. There is, um, you know, a scene where they're attempting to, you know, dissect frogs. And so that's a little tense, but, you know, it, you see there's it. A, it's there, there's drug use. There's sex abuse. There's animal abuse. Just if you want to just be like my wife and just turn away. Yeah, you just, you, you know, know sometimes you can that's, sense that's that's you're all, you have the ability to censor your, yeah. what you see. That's all I do if I'm seeing something. And sometimes I'm that works sometimes for everybody. she misses more of the movie than she needs to. But um, I'm like, honey, it's over. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, uh, but it works. So, um, okay. So definitely push through if you can. Like it's, it's really good because. So cute.